but they've both got the feature of the double chain. Now this Louis Vuitton Epi Leather Twist Lock Bag. Now, Louis Vuitton, I believe, first showed the Twist Lock Bags in the full winter collection of 2014. And they've actually become one of those timeless classics. And this is kind of a slight twist, excuse the pun, on the classic, because as you can see, it's got this extra studding detail here, and it's actually got these extra metal plates as well. It just gives it a kind of more edgy, a bit of a more rock and roll feel. Now this bag would be something similar in size to the Chanel Medium and if you so just... here I've got the Chanel Medium Boy and I've also got the Louis Vuitton Twist Lock. You can see that they're actually a really similar size. Now if I turn to the side you can see quite a similar depth as well. Louis Vuitton probably slightly more spacious once you open it up, but they've both got the feature of the double chain. Now the Chanel Boy, actually the chain is not as long as it is on the Louis Vuitton, which actually makes the Louis Vuitton more versatile because you can not only wear it on the shoulder like so, but you can also very easily wear it across the body like so. Whereas the Chanel Boy, for example, is long like this, but you, you can just about get away with wearing it cross body, but it doesn't sit quite as low. So as I mentioned, it's from one of the seasonal collections. And if we have a little look inside, the bag opens like so and I don't know if you would ever get bored of opening it oh my goodness it's such a satisfying feel and we open it up and it's lined in a kind of micro fiber lining there on the inside and I'll just take out our ticket but you can see inside you've got two slip pockets so just for kind of the necessities and it also comes with a little Louis Vuitton mirror there. Now, Louis Vuitton aren't always the most friendly when it comes to the location of their date codes, but from what I can remember, oh yes, this one's very simple. I don't know if you're going to be able to catch this on camera, but we've got it just here on the inside of the front flap. And I know for a fact I'm not going to try and get it out on camera, but this is from the second half of 2016. Uh, there's a few other really sweet features on the hardware which I just want to point out. You've got engraving there on the top, it says Louis Vuitton, and then you've also got the LV here on the hardware on the side of the twist lock. And on the side, you've got this really interesting, it's slightly, it's slightly more interesting than just having a flat base. The one thing that I would say I prefer this to over the Chanel flap is the fact that you can get so much in it. And I really feel that actually you can wear this in the day and really nicely in the evening as well, because it's just got enough about it that you can sling it on with a leather jacket or with a cocktail dress. It's probably one of my most favorite bags that I've ever had in. And I do think it's probably turning into one of those classics as well. We are seeing it, this would be the third year that we'd have seen it come out. So yeah, I think this is a really beautiful bag. This one in particular, retailed for $4,400. I'm not gonna try and convert that into pounds. I do believe the seasonal ones that are out at the moment in this size, just the kind of classics with no extra bits and bobs are around 2,500 pounds. Guys, thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed this, give it a like, subscribe, and share your thoughts below about this Louis Vuitton twist lock bag. Take care, guys.